Hi everybody and welcome back to my YouTube channel. I hope we're all doing really well. So, maybe you can guess what's happening. I am going home tonight <laughs> for the first time since Christmas Day. Oh no, sorry, since Boxing Day. So if you don't know, I moved to the Wirral in October. I'm originally from uh, Halifax in West Yorkshire and I went home for two days over Christmas but we were allowed to go home. So I literally saw like my mum and my grandma and stuff on Christmas Day and then I saw my dad on Boxing Day and then that's it. I've not seen them since. So I'm going home tonight. I'm so excited. Like I actually cannot wait. Just after I moved to the Wirral, my dad bought a new house and I've literally only slept in it once. <laughs> I can't wait to see it again. It's been so long. So I just thought that I'd do maybe like a bit of a weekend slash week vlog. So it's currently Wednesday, actually currently on my lunch break from work. I'm just doing a little bit of the final packing. So everything's in full motion. Had my eyebrows done last night. Love them. Had my nails done as well. I am obsessed. Like we went for sad faces on this hand and then smiley faces on this hand. Love it. So nails done, eyebrows done. Getting my hair done on Friday. It is so well overdue. I think I'm going to go for a massive change. Not too massive, but massive you know nevertheless so i thought it would be nice to bring you guys along with me it's gonna be an interesting one got lots and lots and lots of things planned so i will probably catch up with you guys when i'm on the way we're setting off tonight about half seven ish maybe eight ish as soon as we get there we're heading to the pub to see my dad <laughs> classic northerner <laughs> i will check in with you guys when i'm in the car with matt see you then guys you are not gonna believe <sighs> the amount of stuff that we've got the car is full behind that there's another suitcase and then in the back there's another gym bag it's just a little bit excessive but would it be me if we weren't being excessive you know only going home for like four days but brought my life with me so yeah we're about to set off in a minute we are 20 minutes away say hi to everybody Hello. we are 20 minutes away we have just had to come over some serious road rage haven't we matt yeah we've got enemies on this motorway oh my god i thought it was raining <laughs> she's screaming off actually is this the highest point of the motorway is this not that big yet my dad's fat. Oh yeah, I'll be dropping the fact. Basically, my dad, every single time we go on the motorway, tells me this every time without... Pardon me. Every time without a doubt, he tells me we have to cross the highest point, the highest motorway. I can't even remember what it is now, but it's like that way. Yeah, man. Did anyone else get like headaches when they've been like really excited for something? <laughs> get headaches when their boyfriend shouts. <laughs> no, like I've just been really excited all day. I've got a little bit of a headache. I think it's because I've been really excited. Do you get that? No, didn't think you would. Anyway, I'll probably speak to you when I'm with L Classic Timmy G. See you in a bit. That sign did tell us that we were on the highest point, <laughs> just to let you all know. Good morning, everybody. I'm home. I'm really sorry I didn't get a chance to film when I saw my dad last night. Listen, Man United were playing and my dad and my little brother are the biggest Man United fans ever. And unfortunately, they lost the game last night. But everyone was pretty gutted, so I didn't think it was appropriate to get my camera out and film. Anyway, today's a very exciting day. It's actually my dad's birthday today. I've got all of his presents here, ready and waiting. Absolutely cannot wait to give him them. Tonight we're going for a nice meal, but before that, today is the day that I am reunited with my mum. Me and Matt are gonna go and see her for a quick half an hour, quick coffee while she's on a lunch break. And then we're gonna come back see my auntie and we're gonna go out for a meal for dad's birthday so yeah it's gonna be a really fun and exciting day and i can't wait to bring you guys along with me i must admit guys it's really really weird being back in halifax weird as well being in this room because i've obviously only slept in it once i'm very excited I'll probably see you in a set when we are i don't know where we'll be who knows so Tim likes his presents. This is Tim, everybody. Say hi, Tim. Hi. She sometimes calls me dad. <laughs> Welcome to the YouTube life, dad. 
It's your birthday. How old are we today, Dad? Um, a bit. <laughs> you so, like your presents, don't you? I love my presents. I've been thoroughly spoiled. Today. It's been fantastic. So good. Well, well that's lucky man. It's not the end of it. In fact, I'll show you the presents. I got Dad this painting done by Libby Marshall, which is, she's a family friend of ours, but she is the most insane artist ever. Also got him a nice picture from graduation and a canvas, and then his birdhouse. Love it. So me and Matt are now going to walk into town to see my mum. And then we're going to go to my auntie's. So I'll probably film whilst I'm with my mum. Speak to you all shortly. There. Yeah, I thought that was her. Is it? Is it all up? Is it all up? I don't want to know Reunited! <laughs> YouTube, this is my mum. Mum, say hi. Hi. To my 124 subscribers. Hi. We Keep subscribing, she's doing marvellous. <laughs> We're having a smoothie with good old Matthew and a catch up. Good to be back, isn't it, Jim? Yeah, definitely. I'm gonna just love you and leave you for a bit, I'm afraid. We've got way too much gossip to talk about that's not appropriate for the internet, so. <laughs> See you in a bit. <laughs> Currently at the best restaurant in Halifax, La Luna. We're all just eating our starters right now, so I don't really want to film the rest of the table because it's a little bit rude. <laughs> okay. Hi, everyone. <laughs> Happy birthday. Dig <laughs> down. Often won't be a part of my YouTube gang yet, will you all? We're just having some starters. It's had a nice bayo bun. I think that's how you say it. Matt's having some. Matt's having some pill pill. Insane. Alfie's having meatballs. Ding dong. <laughs> champagne. Gonna be a star. So that's how tonight's going. I'll show you guys the mains that we get because they are going to be insane. Cheers. Tim's just asking me if he should put his videos on YouTube. Now, just before you answer this question, <laughs> my dad has been doing videos about the variants of COVID that you can get. I will link them in the description box below. <laughs> Do it. Just tell me if you like it or not. They're interesting, that's what we'll say about them. Dad thinks he could be internet sensation with these. Please let me know if you think that he should start his own YouTube. And we'll go from there. It's wonderful, no, thank you very much. It's been lovely. A very happy boy. Wonderful. Good morning, everybody. It's really early, basically. Last night with my family, got a little bit silly. Very good night for Dad's birthday. However, I am feeling slightly worse for wear today, but that's fine because you know where I'm going. I'm gonna go get my hair done. I'm quite nervous because a lot of people recently, well, I say a lot of people, like four people, have said, oh, your hair looks nice. I like the color it is at the minute. Why would people say that when like literally booked in for the hairdressers like on the same week? Because now I feel like I'm going to the hairdressers and I'm paying money for my hair doing when it doesn't need doing, apparently. Do you know what I mean? Anyway, I'm certainly, certainly feeling a change. Covid's just taught me that like the more natural the better, basically, in regards to your hair. I don't know why, I think because obviously they were all shut for ages and I was like left with like yellow hair at one point because it was so brassy. Purple shampoo just it ain't it. It just ain't it, sis, you know? I apologise that I sound like a man, by the way. I literally, I could have one glass of wine or five million glasses of wine and I would still sound like a man the next day. Yeah, so I'm just thinking, shall I just go a bit more natural? Something a bit more easier to maintain, you know? I guess I'll see you guys there. I told you it was going to be different. I am a brunette again. It has been so long since I've been fully brunette. I kind of got there and I was like, Hannah, don't know what I want. Because I was either going to get there and stay blonde and go lighter, or I was either going to get there and be like, yeah, I definitely want to go back to being brunette. Hannah helped me make my mind up. I kept a few highlights of blonde that you can kind of see going through, you know, because we can't let her go that easy. Got to stay for another moment, you know? But I'm loving the brown hair. I think it's a true moment. What do you guys think? <laughs> but yeah, so I'm ready now. And we're going to go and have lunch with my grandma. Don't know how much Barbara will want me to film her, to be honest. Currently wearing just some 
jeans in a crop top situation. Done that thing with the belt hook. I need to just buy some more jeans, but I just can't really be bothered with that. And then we're going to go for drinks afterwards and a few of my friends are coming to meet us. So that'll be really nice. Yeah, I'm looking forward to today. It's going to be great. And you're all going to come along with me. And I'm well excited. <laughs> See you soon. So I didn't vlog when I was with my grandma because yeah. it wasn't right to film whilst I was with Barbara. We were too, too many things to catch up on, wasn't there? But now we're with my friends, my mates. Well, haven't I been the most terrible wannabe YouTuber in the whole entire world? Good morning, everybody. I had a whole 24 hours yesterday and forgot to film, so that's great. So yesterday was my day with my mum, and she came and picked us up at, like, one in the afternoon. But because the night before had been pretty terribly messy, we weren't ready in time. So yesterday was a mad rush, and then once I got there, one Prosecco, two Prosecco, three Prosecco, four Prosecco, easily turned into about 20 Proseccos, and I just forgot to film, so I'm really sorry about that. But... Today's my last day in Halifax. Really sad about it, actually. So I'm just outside having coffee because it's absolutely lovely weather today. Apparently meant to be like a heat wave now. So like today's Sunday to the end of next week, I think. And I'm looking forward to that. Currently having a coffee. It's about half 11 to 12 o'clock and we've only just woke up. And then I need to go back to my grandma's, back to my mum's, pick some stuff up. And then we're actually having a do it. Christine's house tonight. That's my dad's partner who you've seen in the recent video. I'm gonna go to hers and we're gonna have the last supper <laughs> before I go home. We're going home tomorrow morning. It'll be sad, but I've had the best time ever. As you can tell, I really do sound like a man. I sound like I smoke 20 a day. I don't even smoke the alcohol. Actually, this is the first time I've obviously filmed in Halifax. Where I'm sat right now, it's my dad's new garden. It's his new decking. So he's painting the decking green me and my little brother have told him a million times to keep it this lovely brown but he won't oh tim if you're watching don't paint it green matt would you like to say hello to everybody even though i've been the worst i'm a big youtuber in the whole entire world recently she doesn't love you at all guys <laughs> no we're just on the way to mum's now to pick up some more stuff gonna be a little bit emotional saying goodbye i think but not gonna be six more months you know what i mean now it's legal i'll be back a lot more which is good so we're just gonna go pick up some stuff for my mum from the shop and then we're gonna go to hers and get all my stuff that I want to take back for me. And we're going to grandma's and then we're having a takeout tonight, aren't we? In the sunshine. What's it called? Where are we going? Temujin. I've never been before, but dad and Alfie go all the time and I always see them put it on Facebook. Really want some every time. So we're finally gonna experience it. See you soon. Final goodbyes. Final goodbyes. Final goodbyes. Final goodbyes. <laughs> this is boy everyone. I'm gonna miss her. What better to blow away the cobwebs than a lovely bank holiday stroll? Am I right, Matthew? We were just having a chat about dreams and Matt's been having some weird dreams lately. Normally when I have weird dreams, it leaves me feeling really weird the next day, but you don't have that problem, do you, Matt? Normally the next day, if I've had a weird dream, I wake up and I'm like, oh my God, what the hell was that all about? Anyway. <laughs> anyway. an absolutely gorgeous walk, isn't it? El Halifax. I'm just showing him some nice bits of scenery, aren't I? Because but, over in the Wirral, you don't get all the lovely countryside views. Well, that's a country. Well, state, actually, you do get some countryside views. The angry Wirralites on that. <laughs> yeah, don't come for me, please, sexy Wirralites. What a lovely walk. I went to go say goodbye to my mum and my grandma. I was ever so emotional. I'm having a tough day. I don't do well with goodbye. Like, while well, I know it's not a goodbye for six months again, it's only a goodbye for like a few weeks. It's still a goodbye, do you know what I mean? It's not goodbye, it's bye for now. Got in the car, started crying after both times. So, mum, grandma, if you watch it, it was heavy. <laughs> I am <laughs> sad. <laughs> anyway, work up a nice appetite for i'll just take out this evening with the fam yeah chance to be in the vlog sorry for the nudity you're gonna say oh oh yeah what a lovely time we had this weekend my lovely daughter has been home thanks Brilliant. what we're we waiting for alpha what we're we waiting for it's so boring <sighs> we're waiting for a takeaway alpha you've done tiktoks before why would you not just do the for vibes face <laughs> 
<laughs> I am in your spot. Basically, in Christine's garden, she's got these absolutely lovely chairs, but that's the last bit of sun. Christine and my dad are absolute sun worshippers. When we went on holiday, they would literally argue over who got to sit in the sun for breakfast. <laughs> Christine always won. <laughs> I am a little bit of a sun worshipper as well. Actually, I'm a lot of bit of a sun worshipper. I have picked the best seat in the house, unfortunately, and uh, as the script say, I'm not moving. <laughs> You're on fire, girl. And the final goodbyes are in full swing. Before we get emotional, I'd love for everybody to see my dad rocking his new shoes. Look at them. Freshies. Don't need to do that, really, do oh, we? I know, we don't. Alfie bought them for his birthday, didn't I? Do you love them? Love them. Good. But yes, I'm setting off in like, well, whenever Matt's got his shit together, really. It'd be nice to have you, but, uh, you know, nice to have the house back. Rude. Anyway, please excuse the state of me. I've not done my makeup or anything yet. I just thought I'd bring this vlog to a bit of a close now because we're going to be driving home. Uh, we've got some plans later on today with some friends. But yes. Thank you for watching this video. This video has been a really lovely one to film and I can imagine when I go to edit all of this now, it's probably going to make me quite emotional. <laughs> I've had the best time in Halifax and I never thought I'd say that, but it's been such an amazing few days at home with Matt and my family and my friends. And if I saw you over the course of this weekend, thank you so much for coming to see me. I've missed you all so much. Until next time, I guess. <laughs> if you enjoyed this video, please make sure to give it a cheeky thumbs up. If you haven't already, please do subscribe. Yep, that's it. Thank you everybody, bye.